Hello, my friends, and welcome to the grand opening of Bargain Bin Lounge. The show where we look at games that cost only $5 and under. Our first outing for this is Suica Game. It's a game that's like, what, four dollars? Three and a half around there? That's if it's not even on sale. Mm-hmm. Hello, fruit game. Uh, this is, uh, you know, a popular game people know of. A bit of a softball to get us started for this for this whole thing. Do you know how popular Suica Game is? I, I, I really don't. I mean, I've heard people talking about it. I said, oh, I'll give it a shot. Saw there was a free browser version. I'm like, oh, I'll, 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 I'll log in with that. Suica Game is now so popular that Nintendo was giving out free online passes if you got Suica Game. I saw that. I saw that. Which means it has sold so much that it is now considered on Nintendo's popular list. Also, it's in English, which is huge. Well, it's also in, you know, Chinese and more Chinese and Korean and Japanese. So when this was first released on the eShop, there was no English patch, but as soon as it kicked up Steam, that's when it got an English patch, and that way more people came in and played the game. So it was on the eShop, and then it went on to Steam, and then it was in English? I had to... I didn't hear what. Uh, it was on the eShop, not in English, I and then it got so popular it got an English patch. Well, let's jump right into it. This is the most aggravating game I've ever played. See, I don't, I don't think so. This is, this is just kind of chill to me. It's kind of a game to turn oh, your brain off. Oh here. no worries. I'll, I'll point out the bullshit when it happens. So the idea is that you just match uh, fruits together and they turn into bigger fruits, and then you take the bigger fruits and then they, they match into even bigger fruits. But the thing is, you only have uh, the option to add only up to oranges on this scale here. So using that, you have to go all the way to a watermelon. And the physics are very, very uh, finicky. Bad. Finicky Bad. is the word I will- Finicky is the mm -hmm. word I will, yeah, I will they're, continue they're to they're use. They're awful. Sometimes they work. At the uh, least convenient times, they will just go, Oops! What happened? <laughs> I don't know what happened! Oh, well, your fruit's over there now. Also, you stink and you suck at this game. I don't know where you're getting that from. I have video evidence. Of it saying that you stink and are terrible and and bad at life? <laughs> yes, I had to report it. <laughs> you had to report it? <laughs> Goddamn sweet game. Hello, Nintendo, they made fun of me. <laughs> <laughs> they said my mom was a terrible person. She is, in fact, a good person. Well, son, is she? <laughs> <laughs> Nintendo's calling me son. <laughs> <laughs> well, son. <laughs> we at Nintendo have met your mother. She's actually very nice. Thanks, Nintendo. I mean, you know, when she gives us money. Can I have a refund for Suica Game? No! No! <laughs> there are no refunds. <laughs> his blood starts leaking from his eyes, fire from his mouth. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh! Grab, grabs the scuff of my shirt. Jerk <laughs> out! Ooh, uh... You probably could have gotten a couple pears over there. No, I could have gotten an apple. It would have been a... An apple to an apple and then a pear to a pear. It's peach. No, then it would have made a peach. Is this a pear that would maybe like a... I think so. Well, go ahead and drop that, then drop yeah. the orange on top of the other orange, and then watch the magic happen. <laughs> hey, it turned to a pitch. It's a peachy thing. <laughs> I will say there is a bit of strategy to this. The way I got my first watermelon was basically building everything over to the right. And you just have to hope to God that things don't break. Well, I find that uh, haphazardly dropping fruit is not the way to go. Well, no. There is eh. some semblance of strategy to it. And then that stuff happens. Yeah. Hi, Cherry, that'll be there forever. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> You're never getting out. Oh, uh, well, there might be something we can do. There's things we can we can manage here. I wouldn't worry. I am worried. I am worried a lot. Now it's time to worry. Oh, yeah, it's time. Oh, it's time to worry. Ooh, oh, that might actually help you. Uh, yeah. Combine Ooh. strawberries. There hey, we go. Hey, yeah, there we go. All right. Now we just gotta get these peaches to, to touch, or at least make another peach to have them touch. Yes! 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 Please! Please kiss! Oh, there we go. All right, all right. I don't like that big open spot there. Let's see if we can get some fruit to wait hey! up. Hey! I got a pineapple! Now that we have pineapple, we have reached what we like to call uh, DEFCON 3. This is where the music starts changing. <laughs> Those really intense uh, Tetris uh, Grandmaster uh, things. Yeah. Gets 
pulse pounding, the background starts changing and uh, wobbly wobbling. Uh, I'm gonna get the high score, guys! It's gonna happen! <laughs> no! Yeah, you're getting a little fast here. It is so funny, the huge disconnect between the cutesy graphics, the cutesy music, and about half of the videos I saw about this game were cursing the hell out of all these fruit. Do people get mad at this game? Oh, yes. R really? Because they've seen the bullshit I do. You may be able to turn your brain off, but when you get into a competitive mindset and actually trying to get that watermelon, actually win the goddamn well, thing, it gets mean and aggravating. I think I, I must just have a different uh, mindset in this, because I haven't gotten mad at this before. I mean, yeah, I've gotten hit by the ridiculous physics before. I've had, you know, entire fruit just get flung from the top there. That's that, that's always nice. But, oh, where, but I, where I, it explodes? But I never get like, oh, I just go, oh, darn, that's, that's, that's rough. Oh, well, I guess I'll start again then. Not like, oh, that fucking fruit! I'm gonna go wash! I'm, gonna, well, I'm not going that far. I mean, it's it's more like, God! All right, again, one more time. Even even then, that's not where I get. It's like, it is it's like, oh dang! It is. I haven't seen a type of game like this in a long Ooh, time. Melon. Where it is so annoying, the next words out of your mouth are one more go. It's that kind of game where you just go, come on, I was almost there, let me do it again. See, I think what made, what uh, drew me to this game too is that it reminds me a lot of a game called Snood. Ever told you about Snood? Nope. Uh, Snood is a game that, uh, it's it, it's kind of like bust a move for PC. Hmm, okay. It's It's got, it's, it, you got these uh, different colored faces, oh. I suppose, and like they, they wink at you a little bit and you know, you know all that, go. and it's, just the way the game fe it is like a masterclass in game feel. Like it is it is very very addicting. Ew. Yeah, this, this isn't good. I find it's good to just keep matching fruit. Just keep matching fruit, and then eventually your efforts will pay off. That's that's my advice. In hell. My advice from the Zen Suica master oh, here. There we go. So, oh so my god! We got oh a, my god! Got a peach there. Maybe we can drop a. Couple oranges here, make yourself a little little persimmon there, whatever that is. Uh, oh, that's, yeah, that's rough, little friend. That's all right though. Let's keep moving on. Yourself a little grape, yeah, another little grape. We got our whatever that is, a mangosteen. All right. Or a lemon. It's not a lemon. Maybe it is a mangosteen. Lemons are typically yellow in my experience. That's not yellow to you. That's that's yellow to you. That's fucking yellow. Cause I've seen lemons that are that color. Uh, those are some oh, off-looking fucking. Come on, there we go. Those are some <laughs> off-looking fucking lemons you got there, mate. See, it's exciting when they pop together, and it feels really good when multiple pop together, and then you just uh, don't. I have a watermelon. Ah! It's also been a running theme with the people I watch play this. <laughs> After one good combination, oh, <laughs> that's good. And they came. <laughs> Come on! Come on! Push yellow. through! Let's keep yeah! We got this. The yellow. And yeah! The oh. oh, what? <laughs> that. Okay, so you just need to build another apple, but you need to get rid of those yeah. mangosteens. Yeah, we'll get them. Oh, wait. Uh, Yeah, just build there. Well, <laughs> well dingle darn. And now we got plenty of room here to do something. <laughs> what do we get there, that is? That part also doesn't help. The instant transmission over to the other side. Oh. Yeah, that that I'm not a fan of. That's that's sir, that's uh, cost me many a thing, but I'm like more careful about it. So yeah, this isn't looking good. This ain't looking the best, kids. Oh well. Fling that strawberry over there. That's nice. Okay, okay. All right. Working with it, working with it. I can see and those are stuck there forever. It yeah, probably, it probably is. Orange apple, another orange. Well, good night, sports fans. You hang there. Then. Okay. All right. Cherry right there. Right there. 
What, what I've also had happen is that I look at next and think that that's the one that I have. Oh! So it's like, I'm gonna drop this grape right here. No, oh, darn it! Gosh, dang it, darn dang. Pardon my French. That's French? <laughs> uh, how do y'all? <laughs> hey, all right. Okay, go, go hey. lemons. Hey, okay, okay, those aren't lemons. I swear those aren't lemons. Whatever. <laughs> Got a shocked face like I do. <gasps> okay. Okay. So now you need to somehow get an apple done. No, ah, that's okay. We can still make this work. Just gotta keep building here. That's all. That there. That there. Okay. We got a patch. We make another patch. We're looking good. Dump my mango stains over here. Maybe I can build something over here in the meantime. I don't want to put anything between these two. Well, <laughs> well, well, uh, well, yeah, well, guys, I, hmm. Okay. 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 <gasps> nah, I don't, I don't uh -huh. think, I don't think this is the one. This ain't the one, Chief. Here. Yeah, you are. For not a lot of reward. Ah, oh, well. Put him in the blender. Stop! And here's uh, our uh, first fruit pet fruit cocktail on the house. Here you go. Oh, they actually updated it to get rid of the Halloween. I thought that was gonna stay forever. Oh no! I mean, oh, that's I like the Halloween. I did too. That so that that's is that lost media? Like hold up the butterfly. Is this lost media? <laughs> it might come back again for Halloween. That'd be nice. Maybe when it reaches end of life, it'll be a permanent fixture. Oh, that'd be great. Maybe it checks the the system clock, so it's like a time, like only by that, like it's still on the game. That could be interesting. October 1st comes around. Oop, witching Helen. Br hey. Bring it back. Ready for some Halloween Suica? Let's go! Yeah! Let's go! Maybe we'll bring this game back in October. <laughs> Halloween Suica. Halloween ka. Yeah. Alright. I mean, th this, this game is absolutely strategy, but it's also a lot of luck, too. <laughs> and maybe that's why I don't get as, as, as uh, invested or as heated as people get. Like, how mad do people get at this game? I mean, not like, you know, breaking their Switch in half, it's... You can definitely tell it's an aggravated, uh, kind of like pissed off at the moment kind of anger. Just like, oh! Okay, one more time. Again, it's it's not like they're swearing off the game forever, although I've seen some people swear off the game forever. I nearly swore the game off forever because it pissed me off. This is a game I play to de-stress. How? I don't know how! It's soft music playing, it's cute little fruit with cute little faces going, Oh, hey, are you gonna get it this time? It's deceptive fuckery! God! Deceptive fuckery?! Yes. It's just a cute little fruit game! That pisses me off! I must, you know, I think I'm with the devs on this one. I feel like that, uh, they didn't realize how aggravating it would be. It's like, oh, this makes you me- uh, do, 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 okay? Well, How did they not again. realize that? Which means they thought some of these decisions were okay? Oh, come on. It's just a simple physics. That's why it's only like three and a half bucks. Oh, come on. They threw a, ru they threw a rudimentary physics, they got some cute fruit art, and then they said, uh, all right, that's a game. And then it happened to just hit that natural sweet spot, and the internet went crazy. And then I found out about it, I'm like, oh, this is a cute little game. <laughs> I thought you were gonna go a different direction. And then I found out about it, and all of a sudden, it blew up! <laughs> Get in there! Yeah, I'm not that lucky. <laughs> I brought about the Suica movement! <laughs> I, 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 I am no trendsetter. <laughs> there we go, there we go, there we go. That's the stuff, that's the stuff. Alright. That's the stuff. Doing that matching thing. Doing good, doing good. Get in there. Sometimes you get those errant cherries that just like, hey, let's, let's start a whole new thing right here. And you get like four in a row! Yeah. They were more smug in the Halloween update. I do miss the Halloween update, but that song got old fast. That's why you go back to this, where it's all nice and, and pleasant and cheerful. 
This is the kind of song that plays in like those uh, slice of life feel good comedy animes. Where it's, where it's all about uh, rude word jokes. This plays in my therapist's office. De stress. And then I just go in, I start making claw marks in the chair. So what does he do? Is, is he like, you know, sits you at his desk and he's like, oh no, no scope. And he, put, he gets a bowl of fruit. Fruit game. And he gets a square, uh... <laughs> Fit all the fruit in now, your... <laughs> now make a watermelon. <laughs> what an odd request to get from anybody. Make a watermelon. <laughs> and he's like, I, I, I can't, there's no way. And he's like, and he's like uh-huh, uh-huh. And he uh -huh. starts writing stuff down. No, 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 no. You don't need to write nothing anymore. Hey, there we go. Uh, he requests uh, some home health care for you. And <laughs> you'll need an aid. Because <laughs> I can't make a watermelon out of strawberries, cherries, and grapes? Yes. Yes, indeed. Okay. It's, it's worse than I thought. <laughs> what? What? It's terminal. Wait, what? It's terminal? <laughs> What's terminal? <laughs> what do you mean, terminal? Oh, please get in there. Do you know what drink I miss? This, uh, this, this uh, hot 90s drink? Vault. No. Vault's weak. What? It's just, it's just basically mellow yellow with uh, with some step- Ten with some, times the extra sugar. <laughs> with, with some pep in it. Yeah. yeah. I'm talking about Fruitopia. Oh man. You know I never tried Fruitopia when it was around, but I knew all about it. Like, I think I, I was like about to get into high school when they stopped making it. Almost. Shame. That might, that might have been it. Because I remember, cause I, remember I, I got Fruitopia like all the time in high school, in the, like eighth grade, and then it just it just kind of stopped. Yeah. But I miss Fruitopia. It was it was a, like you just look at the bottle. It's like oh god, it's so refreshing. It's so fruit. See, I bet this is what they did in order to make a, a bottle of Fruitopia. Yeah, just take all the all the fruits together. And, hey, oh. There we go. Okay, now we've reached difficulty. All right, just keep adding your uh. Just, just keep the oranges piling up, because they'll turn to apples. Alright. Okay, we're getting the rainbow here. Alright. Okay. Oh, th th that gigantic gap under the pineapple is murder. Yes. Uh. Yes. I need you for fruits to shift. Please. Oh, and they just keep rotating too. It's Stop. like a, it's like a, a working machine of fruit cogs. Do 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 fruit 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 and fruit 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 fruit. Oh no! All right, let me go one more, one more. Let's do it again. I will gladly take second place out of second place. Well, who knows? This could be third. Or it could be first, rocketing me to second place. And then a fruit blasts out of the out of the box. <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa! There is fruit on my ceiling! Oh no! I get an email from a bunch of tassers saying, hi, let's talk. <laughs> Did you find the trick? What trick? Yes. You are correct. Only 0.01% of all players are able to do that. It's like, well, I must not be one of them. The UDJ skip. The what? The what? No. <laughs> yeah. Speed running sweet game. Okay, so if I get the perfect RNG, I get the uh, cherry, strawberry, grape, and then it just rockets out of there, and there you go. It, it, it's like a 50-year-old grandpa just, you know, playing some some games. Like, oh, I'm, I'm just, yo, know, uh, doing it for the grandkids, you know, just... I like Shrieka game. I like Sweet game, and then all of a sudden it's like, whoa! How did you pull up that trick, old man? And w w what old trick? And then they na they name it after him. You know, they have conventions. You know, they, he's talking and stuff like, how did you pull up the trick? He's like, I don't know what trick you're talking about. I was just playing the game. Hell yeah, the Jim Parsons skip. We love the to Jim see it. Parsons we skip. love to see it. Good job, Jim. Grandpa Jim, I had it again, man. Sweeka, Sweeka, Sweeka. <laughs> Jim Parsons. I don't know. She's <laughs> pulling a name out of nowhere. It's Sheldon from Big Bang Theory. Oh, is it really? I think. Okay. I don't know who it is. 
Just for some reason, that was the first name that came into the forefront of my mind. It's like, why am I... If that actually is the actor from Big Bang Theory, I I really hate Big Bang Theory. Yeah, and yeah, probably, you probably hate yourself right now. Yeah, probably a little bit. I am currently sitting and talking over Fruit Game again. It brings out the worst in you. I think I, I do remember uh, I was just laying down in bed after four okay last game. <laughs> Another defeated attempt at sweet kick. <laughs> I mean, I would play this right before I go to sleep. Yeah. And just be like, okay, one more game. Okay, one more game. And then an hour passes. And oh, it's no. like, all right, motherfucker, I'm doing this in one more game. Took a screen cap when I finally got a watermelon. Whether I beat it or not, I even took a uh, video clip of it too. And I said, hey, look, I beat fruit game. Never have to play this again. Have you ever found out what happens when you combine two watermelons? Because the game doesn't end when you get a watermelon, it keeps going. It's, yep. a, it's a score based game. When you get two watermelon, they disappear. Yep. And that's it. Therefore, the game continues. So you get a high ass score. So, since it's a score based game, I beat it. I got the biggest evolution. Congrats for winning. I beat Fruit Game. But is that enough for you? Yes. Look, I was working on, like, five other games at the moment, and this one was taking up all my time out of nowhere. Fruit game, please. Have mercy. Oh, I know the feeling. I, I, I was playing Spider-Man 2 when I first got this, and, uh... Guess what took more time than I thought? I should be playing something else right now, but no fruit game. It's like, well, yeah, I could pop in Spider-Man 2, but, uh, you know, I'm kind of tired. I gotta go to work soon. Uh, let's do some fruit game. Seriously, I want to see... I want to see a psychologist analyze this game, because it truly does have the appeal of just one more game. And, God, if any AAA developer ever figured out the trick behind it, yikes! It's just a, it, it's just an addictive gameplay loop, that's all. Civilization does the same thing. Okay, what are their, uh, this is not Civilization, so please explain. <laughs> Alright, so Civil Civilization is a uh, 4X game, it's a... Uh, Turn-based, uh, explore them up, research them up, war them up, religion them up type type of game. It's it's a board game for PC. Religion them up. <laughs> Shoot crosses at non-believers. But the, but uh, games take hours. Even on the on the fastest speed, they take hours. And it, it's all based on turns. Like you know, I think the lowest amount of turns you can do on one game is like 250 turns. A fast game is like 300, a typical game is 500 turns. So you're not going to do it all in, in one night, so you got to save it and end. But the difficulty is... How many turns before you, before you stop for the night? Just one more turn. That's one more turn. Mm. Well, I'm getting a wonder next turn, so just one more. Well, I need to, you know... I'm, I'm, I'm finally getting this upgrade, so uh, one more turn. Well, you know, Montezuma declared war on me, so uh, one more turn. We are very but, different in our in our definition of just one more game. But this is a much more a simplified version because the games go so fast. So because of the speed at which you can play games, that's where you get just one more game, one more game, one more go, one more turn, one more one more quarter in the arcade machine. I just thought because it uh, it personally insulted me and my family. How does lineage. it insult you? It's it's the faces. That's what it is. The faces are looking into the, you and judging you. The smug you. Halloween faces did not help. I get that. I think one had its tongue sticking out of me. I was like, you, you motherfucker. I'm not gonna let you win. If it's any consolation, he was sticking at his tongue because it's, you know, cute and spooky, not because he was making fun of you. He's making fun of me. I know when I'm being made fun of. I am on the internet. I know when people are making fun of me. <laughs> it's called being on Twitter. It's called being online. Terminally online. Yeah. Oh god, have I reached that moment? Back to the therapist I go. I really need to hire a therapist. It's like, yes, it appears as you are terminally online. You need uh, therapy. Uh, Time to put you down. Here, here's my Twitter handle. Uh, DM me and we'll talk. Are you actively aiding in my addiction? What addiction? Now pay for Twitter blue. Okay. <laughs> Right, right there to get the, uh, there you go. There you go. Alright, maybe I can clear away some of these. That was not the way to do it. Well, okay. In theory, 
something's oh, happening. Uh, no. Oh, well. I was wait, about to say, hold on. Two, yeah, two grapes to get a tangelo, whatever those are. Wanna make a tangelo? I gotta break a few grapes. Ah! Oh! Magistine fell out. You broke grapes! Hey, you did get third. That was third. That. So I got first and third place today. Hey! Hey! In a game that's certainly addictive. I think it's sweet. Boo. Well, to me, it's uh, just a cute little uh, time waster game, just to de-stress from playing, you know, real games like Street Fighter Six and stuff like that. Game of stuff. Yeah. All right. Thanks for watching. Uh, see you next week for some other cheap crap that might be a bit more aggravating than this. See you then. Are you are, are you feeling okay? I was told if I fidget, it helps with my ADHD. Oh, here, why don't you have some of the uh, delicious fruit uh, smoothie that we made? Okay, it's a V8 for you. See you next week!